accuracy of your monitor is only part of obtaining high quality and accurate measurements. Hi, I'm Mark from Bias Medical. In this video, we will explain the proper measurement techniques for getting high quality measurements from your BIOS wrist monitor. It is important to be calm and not be affected by mental stress that can influence your blood pressure. Remove any accessories and roll up your sleeve. With your palm facing upwards, strap the cuff to your wrist. The monitor should be facing up and you should be able to read the screen. It's important to have your wrist at heart level. You can support your wrist by using a rolled up hand towel or the storage case included in the box. While the measurement is being taken, do not speak and do not move. Try not to tense the muscles in your measuring arm. In preparation for a measurement, rest quietly in a room at a comfortable temperature for at least five minutes. If you are taking multiple readings, do not take the cuff off, but wait approximately one minute between subsequent readings. It is best to measure your blood pressure at the ends of the day because your blood pressure is most variable during the middle of the day. Take your morning readings first thing after you've gotten out of bed, before you've had any coffee or tea or breakfast, and make sure that you go to the bathroom first. In the evening, wait at least two hours after dinner. And if you've had any coffee or alcohol, or you have had any exercise, wait at least another 30 minutes. Repeat this pattern for seven days and average your systolic and diastolic readings, and this will be your average blood pressure. It's important to know that blood pressure variability is natural, and it can change minute to minute. This happens when you take sequential readings. It's very normal for your blood pressure to fall as you take subsequent readings as you become more relaxed. Remember, all bias monitors have been recommended by Hypertension Canada and have undergone clinical validation studies that meet or exceed Hypertension Canada's criteria.